Your water landing light vest is found under your seat. Remove sharp objects from... One hour later. Touchdown, Lagan Dingan City. Hey guys, so from the airport, magkapan kami papuntang Agora Terminal. So that's 200 pesos each. We're finally here at the Agora bus, Agora Terminal, guys. Before taking a bus to Balingoan Port, we decided to have our lunch here at Mr. 8 Fast Food, which is a local eatery here in CDO. They have lots of dishes to choose from and very affordable pa guys. I ordered their Mongo Bicol Express and a cup of rice for only 120 pesos. Yarn. <laughs> then we grabbed some donuts from a local donut shop, Mr. Poppers, for our trip later. So yeah, make sure to try them out. So upon entering the bus terminal itself, you need to pay a terminal fee of 5 pesos each. Then you need to take a bus going to Butuan and ask the driver to drop you at Balingoan Port. Guys, we're on our way to Balingoan Port. So 198 lang yung fare. Kapag air condition and kapag non-aircon, non 158 lang. 158 lang. Many hours later. Guys, update. So it's already 2.25. Nandito na kami sa may balingoan. Ayan, very late na. So, konting lakad na lang. Tapos pupunta na kami sa may port. Now it's raining. So after two hours of traveling, we're finally here at Balingo and Port. So guys, before you purchase your ticket, make sure to sign up for an account at alvisitkamigin.com and download the QR codes on your phone because you're going to be needing that at the Kamigin Port as well. Once done, have it scanned first at the designated booth. Also guys, you're going to be paying for environmental fee which is 15 pesos each, terminal fee of 15 pesos each, and shuttle ferry uh, going to Kamigin Island is 359 pesos each. So, 
Since it was already late and there were no jeeps around anymore, we decided to join the three tourists in a private motorella and ask the driver to drop us at Barangay Agoho where our accommodation is located. Bench and I only paid 150 pesos each for the uh, ride. Guys, we're finally here at SJ Paba Travelers Inn. Finally, finally, finally. Yan, nakakapagpahinga na tayo. Hello mga horror! This is your girl Luisa and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And yes guys, welcome to my first travel vlog for this year. And yes guys, we are here in Kamigin Island. So, yon, this is my first time dito sa Kamigin Island. And after ng Kamigin guys, magbubukid nun na rin kami. So, stay tuned din kayo sa vlog uh, for that one. So, yon, so, ito na yung details kung paano pumunta dito. If in case, bet nyo rin pumunta ng Kamigin Island. So, let's start with your flight guys. If you're also coming to Manila, you need to book a flight going to Cagayan de Oro. So, that's the cheapest one na. Pero actually, hindi nga ganun ka-cheap kasi nang book lang kami around January lang then. And January din yung uh, flight namin papunta dito. So, it's kind of mahal. Pero, it would be cheaper if meron kayong uh, SEP Pass. Uh, display ko na lang dito kung magkano binayaran ko for this flight. You also have the option guys na mag-direct flight to Kamigin. Kaso nga lang, super mahal na niya. Kasi siguro baka maliit lang yung aircraft na papunta dito sa Kamigin and Yun, if you want cheaper, mas better na lang yung Cagayan de Oro. And yeah, dito pala kami nag-stay sa si may SJ uh, Pabwa Travelers Inn. So, more lang siya guys. For two nights, nakuha namin siya ng 1,780. So, that would be 890 pesos each from Agoda. So, link is also available in the description uh, box ng uh, video na to. If in case, bet nyo rin dito mag-stay. Pwede na rin kayo dito mag ng motor kasi meron na rin sila. Just message them para at least uh, aware sila na gusto nyo mag and all. And with that, let's do a quick room tour. Hey guys. Yan, medyo madilim na. Ito yung labas ng room namin. So, yan. Very nature vibe. Ito yung sa room namin. Room number 4. So, meron ditong table and chairs. Pasok na tayo. Ito guys, yung bed. Good for two naman na siya. Of course, may aircon. And enough space para lagay ng gamit nyo and may mini uh, drawer uh, dito. Meron ding TV Dito, ayan, small lang siya, pero okay na rin. And charging station, lagay ng mga gamit nyo and all. Shot na natin yung CR. Tada! May mirror naman. What I like about it is magkina siya, guys. So, may shower. Walang hindi nga lang siya natin gold. And ito, may tabo naman. No bidet. That's it. All details will be available sa screen and of course sa description box ng video na to guys. And the expenses na rin, ilalagay ko na rin dito para at least may idea kayo kung magkano yung magagastos nyo for the Kamigin trip. So magpapahinga muna kami. Then later lalabas kami for dinner. See you guys! Dito kami sa labas guys. Thank you. Ang deleng. Hahanap kami ng makakainan. Ito kami guys sa may ATV ano, a few steps lang galing dun sa may SJ Park. Bukas lang siguro kami mag-checkpoint kasi medyo malayo siya dito. Pero they sell mga barbecues here. Tsaka may mga ulam naman. So nice na rin. Here's our dinner. Nilagang baka guys. Tapos chicken barbecue. Tapos yun pa yun yung babakwa. Let's eat. Also guys, here at SJ Pabwa, they have a common area where you can cook uh, for free and of course, they have a free drinking uh, water as well. So, may place din sila na pwede nyo tambayan. Good morning guys. So, 3.20am na. So, mag breakfast muna. Kaya nga, grabe, grabe yung ulan dito kanina. Oh my god, sana mamaya may hindi na. Tapos, ang lamig-lamig dito guys. So, make sure magdala kayo ng jacket if in case pupunta din kayo ng around. Ganitong month or probably uh, next month. Mm, good morning. Good morning. Huh? Ganito yung weather ngayon. Ayan, 25 degrees. Tapos, maulan na naman. Oh, no. 
Here is our breakfast. Three in one coffee, to guys. Tapos ito cup noodles. Then I'll fry up the cinder yung donut kagabi. Guys, grabe yung ulan. Oh my god. Good morning! So, almost 6 a.m. na. Mukhang tuloy na yung tour namin. So, if you also plan to do yung uh, White Island tour, so yung, uh, yung pump boat rate dito, guys, is 550 uh, pesos siya. Good for 4 passengers na yun. Tapos, mag-add na lang kayo ng 50 pesos each for the uh, entrance fee. So, yun. Medyo madaling pa rin naman. But, hopefully, wala nang uh, ulan later. So, let's go! Ganda dito, grabe. Para siyang ano, wala siyang mga sheds dito, guys. Ha? So ayan, kung nakarating na kayo ng Siargao, para siyang naked island. Para mas better kasi mas malaki yung sand park nila dito, grabe. Ayan, no? like from doon, mas dito. Ayan! So, pag sa drone shot, mas ma-appreciate nyo yung uh, itsura ng buong island. Pero of course, if you don't, if you don't have a drone, ma-appreciate nyo pa din naman yung island talaga pag na uh, na kayo. As in, ang ganda. Maganda na nga siya na itong medyo hindi maaraw. What if uh, super maaraw talaga siya? Mas maganda talaga siya guys. Yun. Person. So, ayan o. Oh. May mga clouds na na naman to. So, oh my God. So, na hindi na talaga umulan. So, we're still waiting for the araw para at least mga pagkakaroon. No? Yeah. Siguro uh, for now, we'll just enjoy the uh, place. And guys, wala palang mga nagbabenta dito. So, if in case magtatagal kayo dito, make sure to bring your own baon, no? Or snacks. Meron namang bilihan doon sa may uh, jump-off uh, area. And, yeah. Three hours ata kayo pwede magstay dito. So, if in case gusto niyo na bumalik doon sa may uh, jump-off area, yan. Tawagan or text yun na lang yung number na binigay nila sa'yo. Kasi may signal naman dito, guys. May phone signal naman dito sa white. I love you guys. Let's go! Hey guys, so we're still here at the White Island. So yun, medyo umulan kanina. Ngayon naman, medyo umaaraw na ng konti. And nadadagdagan na yung mga ano, dito, tourists dito sa White Island. Hopefully, <laughs> ano, completely umaaraw na talaga siya para mas maganda naman sana sa video and pictures, right? Pero ganda pa rin naman dito guys. May enjoy nyo pa rin siya talaga. It's 8.43 a.m. na. So, we're done with the uh, White Island. So, naglalakad na kami. Pupunta kami sa may checkpoint. So, parang kainan siya dito. Famous one then So, dun kami. Hindi po. Dun kami mag-breakfast uh, muna. Tapos, dun si Kong uh, saan na kami pupunta after. Ito guys, yung checkpoint. Kaso, they're still closed. Mamaya pa atay mo pa nila. So, nandito kami ulit guys sa may abang ETD. So, dito na kami mag-breakfast. So, nandun lang banda dun sa unahan yung uh, kung saan kami nagsistay. So, yan siya. So, pati yung food. Okay, 
since it's already 10.30 in the uh, morning. So, nag-wash up na kami. Palit ng top. Tapos, yeah, mag-tutor kami today. So, nag kami ng multi-cab. So, that's 2,300 for two packs na siya. Pwede siya, guys, at eight locations. Pero kami tatlo lang kasi maulan ngayon. So, parang hindi mo din ma-appreciate yung ibang uh, destinations. So, mostly yung pupuntahan lang namin for this tour is yung Mantigue, Sunken Cemetery, and yung Tuwasan Falls. And siguro mga summer na pwede kainan na lang siguro along the way. Ito, guys, yung uh, hinarin namin na... Uh, Multi-cab. So, dalawa lang kami. So, it will be uh, cheaper if in case marami kayong mag uh, ha So, ilagay ko na lang sa description box and sa screen yung number ni Kuda. If bet nyo rin for the tour. Okay? A few moments later. Our first destination for today is the Sangan Cemetery. So, nagalag book mo na kami dito sa tourist uh, center nila. Sa tapat lang siya uh, mismo. Good morning! Ito nila to Renton, no? I think isa la kayong talang snorkeling gear. Ayan. Tapos pagpasok nyo dito, mayroon dito ang souvenir shops. Good morning! <laughs> morning po! <laughs> Dami sila dito ng souvenirs. Hi! There is the Sunken Cemetery, guys! Gusto nyo guys mag-swimming or tumawid uh, papunta doon. Pwede kayo mag-grant ng boat. So that's 150 pesos. Good for you. And balikan na rin. So, ihati nila kayo pagpunta doon. Then, uh, pabalik din. Igagayad din nila kayo pabalik dito sa may uh, shoreline. Alright? Tingnan muna namin sa baba before kami mag-decide if um, tatawid kami pagpunta doon. Ata guys, yun yung, uh, yung video na movie. Ngayon, before. Video ata yun, if I'm not mistaken. The sunken cemetery in Camigan, Philippines was created when a volcanic eruption in 1871 caused the burial ground to sink underwater. Now, it serves as a unique historical site where visitors can see submerged tombstones and cross markers, offering a glimpse into the island's past. We're done here sa Sunken Cemetery. Hindi na kami uh, nag-snorkeling kasi <laughs> grabe eh yung lamig. Tsaka ang lakas ng current kasi. So may pupuntahan pa kami after. Siguro mag-swimming na lang kami sa may Mantigi Island uh, later. So, let's go! Hello mga Karor! Update! So we're finally here at the Wasson Falls. Ito yung signage niya. Meron uh, din doon sa part na yun. So yeah, hindi ko lang alam kung may entrance fee dito. But uh, yeah, let's see! Okay guys, kailangan din dito yung clean kamigi na QR code. So make sure na nakasave siya sa phone nyo. And they have entrance fee of 75 pesos each. Yeah. So now we're here at the Wasson Falls. So yun so. The Wasson Falls is a stunning waterfall in Camigin, Philippines. It's perfect for swimming and relaxation amidst lush greenery. Today, as a popular tourist destination in the island, the Wasson Falls continues to attract visitors seeking respite and connection with nature. Ano po yan? Keeping Hotkey. Ooh. 
Tipping guys, 10 pesos lang. Mag sure na try nyo ito pag pumunta kayo dito sa may Tuwasan Falls. Dito lang kay ate. Guys, we're done here sa Tuwasan Falls. So, nagpalit lang ako. And, we're gonna head to Mantiki Island. Let's go! Hi guys, so anyway, it's already 2.31 in the afternoon, so guys, canceled yung Mantigi Island namin kasi hindi na kami maabot sa cut-off and maalon din daw kasi, so yun, um, ginawa na lang namin, yung tanong na lang kami kung saan pa kami pwedeng pumunta and we're here sa Katungan Park, so this is a mangrove park guys, at meron din ditong restaurant, so if ever gusto yung pumunta dito, they have entrance fee of 30 pesos per pack, so yun. At least may pwede pang puntahan if in case hindi pwede yung Mantige Island. Malapit lang naman siya. Yun! Let's explore the area. Ganda dito guys, mag-pictorial pala and video-video. Pwede siguro kayo dito mag-rent ng cottage. Tapos, ah, uh, tulad ng kanila. Guys, ingat lang pala kayo. Or else, final destination. Char. Guys, yung late lunch namin dito sa may Katunggan uh, Park. So, 4 c siya. And this is worth 300 pesos. Tapos yung rice, 20 pesos each. So, let's eat, guys. We're back from our tour. So, yun. Sayang hindi kami nakapagmantigi island. Sobrang ano talaga. Sama ng panahon. And, yeah. May cut-off sila pala for that if bad talaga yung uh, weather uh, dito sa Kamigen. So, anyways, if plan if plan nyo din na pumunta ng Kamigen, so make sure to check yung weather siguro kung okay talaga at the time ng punta nyo. Kasi kung sunod-sunod yung uh, ulan, so most likely uh, may hirapan kayo sa mga tours dito. And better if kung marami kayo, mag na lang kayo ng multicab guys for tour. So, yung sa dito pala ay na kinuha namin na tour guide with multicab na siya sa SJ Pabuas. Pabuas siya mismo. So, if in case dito rin kayo magsistay, pwede kayo magtanong doon sa may-ari kung paano kayo makakapag-rent ng uh, multicab. So, kung marami kayo, medyo mataas sa 2.5 uh, yung babayaran nyo talaga. So, normally 2.5 siya kapag dalawa lang daw na tao. So, 2.3 kasi binigay kasi may discount kami galing doon sa may-ari mismo. So, yun. Guys, uh, magpapahinga na lang muna kami, then pack up na later kasi bukas maaga yung biyahe namin pabalik, pabalik ng Balinguan Port kasi magbubukid doon kami. So, ilang sakay na naman yun tomorrow. So, we really need to get a rest. So, wala na kami pupuntahan bukas dito sa Kamigin. Sayang lang kasi sobrang short lang ng trip namin dito. Siguro next time, no? Ayan. See you later. So, it's already 7.23 uh, in the evening. So, nandito kami sa labas para uh, mag-dinner. Nandito kami sa may La Isla Cocina. Tapos, parang tie-up din sila with Paradiso uh, Resort. So, along the way lang siya. Malapit na siya sa SJ Papa. Uh, if you want mga Italian food or Mexican food, pwede kayo dito. Come on. Here's our dinner. This is spaghetti at the Then, boy, it's so wine pizza guys it's worth 350 pesos tapos 8 slices 8 ba? 12? Mm -hmm. sobrang laki ganyan ang dami kaya tapos ugly oil yung 
order kami around two ninety ata siya. Super sweet. Good morning. So this is our last couple of hours dito sa Akamigin. So right now it's seven a.m. and nakapag chat out na kami dito sa may SJ. Papua. By the way, we had a great stay. Okay, yung place nila dito, guys. Very nature vibe. Tapos may common area pa where you can cook and probably use your utensils and all. Aga kami mag-check out kasi kailangan na namin uh, bumiyahe pabalik ng Cagayan de Oro and bumiyahe kami papuntang Bukid nun after uh, ward. So, yeah, uh, ngayon mag-aabang kami ng motorella sa labas sa, tapos kay ulit papuntang Benoni Port. So, update ko na lang kayo, guys, kung paano and how much uh, it would be. Okay? Magmamotorella kami papunta ang Binoni Terminal. We're currently here at Binoni Terminal na. So, CR lang kami and then ito yung sasakyan namin papunta ang Binoni uh, Port. That's it for this vlog. Thank you so much mga karor for watching. I hope you still enjoyed our very short trip to Kamigin Island. And yeah, please don't forget to like, share, and comment on this video if you have questions. And of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. I'll see you guys on my Bukit Nan vlog. Bye!